Okay guys, uh, this is a SE plugin for your PSP. It just came out. It's uh, called the um, Battery Warning uh, Version 0 0.1. And I don't know what the hell is up with this version 0.1s. There can't be a point or point one version. Like there can only be a version one. I don't understand that. But whatever. I just kind of find it like ironic. But anyways, um, I'm gonna show you how to install this SE plugin on your PSP. Uh, you need to be on custom firmware for this, obviously, because it's an SE plugin. You can't really access a recovery mode in a uh, official firmware PSP, except for that um, that game state thing or whatever. But um, other than that. Let's uh, get to it. I will have the link for this next to this video for you guys to download. And uh, yeah, so let's make this simple as pie. So let's go. Alright, so here we are at the PSP. And I'm simply just going to go to system settings here and check my firmware for you guys. And you can see I'm running on 5.50 Gen D3 for my custom firmware. And I'm just going to go and go to my USB connection and connect the USB cord from my PC and then come to the computer. All right, so the file I'm gonna have you download is right here. It's called battery underscore warning underscore plugin underscore version 0.1.zip. Double click on that and open that up. And I'll get that out of the way, close. And inside here, you're gonna see a battery warn underscore version 0.1 folder. Open that folder up and you will see a BATT uh, warn PRX folder. Open that up and inside here, you will see the batwarn.prx, the game.txt, and the vsh.txt. So I'll simply leave that there for now. Go to my computer and open up the removable drive for your PSP. Open now. If you haven't already, all in lowercase letters, make a folder called SE Plugins, spelt just like that. Open that up, and you will see that I already have some stuff in here. Yada 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 yada. Hooray! Anyways. It was a uh, oh yeah all right so uh, basically what we're gonna do now from the extraction program if you don't have an extraction program just say extract all these to desktop uh, by right clicking on the zip file that I've given you but uh, basically take the b a t t warn dot p r x and drag and drop that into your se plugins folder on your PSP memory stick now if you haven't made a game and vsh text documents just simply drag and drop these into your PSP's uh, SE plugins folder on the memory stick. But if you have got these, you're gonna wanna take this and uh, you're gonna wanna select all this. So highlight, what the fuck? Highlight all of that. So highlight that right there in your uh, game text, right? And the VSH, both text documents say the same thing. I just put them in there in case you don't have them already and select copy. Uh, exit that and then come to your PSP memory stick. Now, if you drag and drop these from the extraction program, you're not going to need to do this step, but if you already have them, this is the step you're going to need to do. So open up the VSH document right here, and you're going to just hit Control V or Command V if you're using a Mac, um, and paste that so that you have this written in your VSH.txt in your SE plugins folder, MS0 colon forward slash SE plugins forward slash batwarn.prx space one exit your vsh text save it and then go to the game text and hit control or command v as well to paste that in there and uh it would also read inside your game text document ms0 colon forward slash se plugins forward slash batwarn.px prx space one Exit your game text on your PSP memory stick and save that as well. So to make sure that we have that, you want to have the game text with the MS0 colon forward slash SE plugins forward slash bat worn dot PRX space one written in it. And you also want it in the VSH dot TXT as well. And also make sure that you have the bat worn PRX file itself inside the SE plugins folder on your PSP memory stick. So after that, exit that, exit this, and come back to the PSP. All right, so back at the PSP, we're gonna exit USB mode here. Now I'm just gonna use the basic function because everybody's PSP to access their freaking recovery menu is different now because of all the new custom firmwares and stuff. So basically what we're gonna do is hold the power button up until it turns off. This is like 
the main way to do it. This is like the first invented way. Now, hold down the right trigger and put the power back on. Slide this over so you can see it. Hey, it's me in the screen, yay. And here we are at the recovery menu. So now, basically what we're gonna do is scroll down to plugins and you're gonna look for the um, the battery worn PRX uh, in brackets with game and also in VSH. So uh, there we are and you're gonna enable it. It should automatically be enabled but it also depends on what firmware you have. So there's the battery worn PRX for the game in brackets and that's enabled. And we'll scroll up to the battery worn PRX in VSH. Ooh, that's also enabled. So that's about that. Just make sure those are enabled. Go back, hit exit. Your system will reboot now. And that about does it. That's enabled. And I don't have my battery power low enough for it to show. But basically what it's just going to do is there's going to be a little text going across the screen on the top here from about, well, let's see. Let's get an example. From the network icon to the music icon across the screen right here. So, like, it won't go this far. It will just go, like, that far. Um, it'll say warning battery 10% um, or something like that. So... That's about it, and it only turns on when it's like 10%, but it's useful. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. So, yeah, that's how you install the battery warning uh, PRX plugin for your PSP uh, version 0 0.1. Um, basically, all this is for is to let you know when your battery is dying. So, um, who the fuck is this? I hate when people text me and it's like, I don't even have their number. How do you get my number, you know? What do you, you know what? I, that's, I fucking hate that. But anyways, um, that's about it. Um, yeah, so uh, thanks for watching. I hope this helps. I hope you enjoy this little plugin. What the fuck? Um, uh, who's this? Send. Leave me alone, people. Um, I will have the link next to this video for you guys. And um, other than that, yeah, so this is the plugin for you. Um, if you have any questions, leave me a comment, send me a message. You got any recommendations for any other videos that you want, just leave a comment on my channel. And don't worry, everybody that I got, um, I'm working on the videos that you recommended for me. I've just been busy with going fucking shopping and emailing and setting up for college and stuff. So don't worry, you'll get your videos soon. <laughs> I promise. Um, hopefully I'll do that today uh, or at least get five of them down. I got like fucking 10 recommendations for videos i got bombarded so um because i've been so goddamn busy but um other than that yeah I, I will have that for you guys uh subscribe to my channel to keep up to date and uh yeah i will talk to you guys later and enjoy this new se plugin for you guys take it easy